It starts on this journey 20 years ago. And it's been simmering in his mind ever since. What has really been going through his mind all those years? How's he going to uh, react when he actually sort of approaches that area where he sort of nearly lost his life? Because in the end, this is this is what the whole thing's all about. The story of Bonnie Pins Charlie, the treasure and everything suddenly evaporates. See what happens. Wow, look at that. It's so beautiful. That's the mouth of the river. Incredible. When I, when I came down the mountainside when I was here 20 years ago, I came down this way. But that is definitely where I came down and found myself stranded in this tiny cove. And I'm just thinking here, you know, how amazing that I was picked up from that cove. There's nobody here. A similar time of the year. I could have, you know, I could have waited there forever and a day and nobody would have come. Not a soul. Not a soul. As far as the eye can see, it's amazing. As far as the eye can see, nobody. I can see down there the mouth of the stream, a stream, it must be the stream. I never saw it before, but that's going to run up this way through the glen, underneath the footbridge. And it's somewhere on the other side of that footbridge that I found the mysterious staff of Gouldvay. Whatever that may mean, it's incredible to be alive, to be alive now here in this incredible place after all these years, still alive, still alive, it's unbelievable. Maybe it's all just a, maybe all this, this moment, the whole thing is just one beautiful illusion. Maybe I'll wake up tomorrow and, and uh, it'll all be gone. Well, it will be gone soon enough, whether it's an illusion or not. came here 20 years ago, I looked death in the face. Dear God, I was lucky to get away with my life. 
I was 38, I suppose. And maybe it was, I don't know, maybe it was the, the last official day of my youth or something, I don't know. I'm 58 now. You know, time has stood still in this place. Well, maybe time has stood still for me. birthday too. So happy birthday to me. We're up above the clouds. Up above the clouds. Wow. Down there where the mists are now the wood in the base of the glen, that's where I found the, the mysterious staff. We come down from the mountain in the morning before we actually enter the glen, um, and that's going to be a, a key moment Place that I've been waiting to to return to for all these years. I'm, I'm I, I, I can't wait. It's the same place. The bridge is different, it's just that the bridge looks different. Everything else is, it is the same. So I'm here. I've returned. I offer you my hand.
cool. I'm sorry. Sorry, Mum. Sorry, Anne. Sorry. All the people. I'm sorry that I let you down. I'm sorry that I never quite measured up to your expectations of me. Sorry that I've hurt you. I'm sorry I've, that I've confused you. I'm sorry that I've kept you waiting. Um, I'm sorry that I didn't make you more proud. Sorry I couldn't have done better. It's the way it is. I mean, you know, if you say sorry to people, say sorry to God, you know. I'm, I'm sorry, God. I've wasted my life. What's he going to think of that? Perhaps that, you know, this, this is my way of... My way of saying sorry. A love letter from me to you, the people that love me. Something to make you proud of me, if you can be. You know, it can't make up for all the time that's been lost, but it's, uh, it's something.
gold isn't just stuff that you find in the ground or in a box marked X on the map. You know, your life it consists a lot of the time in, in thinking about the past and and your place in it and the friends you had. And you you gather up fragments of gold from those. Gold dust. To go of all the things I nearly done, I nearly met the Arga Khan. Oh, yes. <laughs> I nearly buzzed the southern piers with Avis in his death machine. I nearly traversed across the desert on a camel with the Bedouin. I nearly painted golden towers. I nearly practiced the guitar for hours. I nearly saw the meaning of her suffering soul. I nearly stormed the pitch and scored a goal. I nearly entered my account on time. I nearly was an honest man. And of the things I nearly done, when all that's nearly done is through, what's done, what isn't, when the bell has rung, there is nothing left to nearly do. I can't grasp a late degree, I'll ever say it was for lack of loving thee. So let my heart be open and my way be true, and let me put aside the things I nearly done, and bring me daily closer to the things that I do do. <laughs> You did write that, and I think it's rather a good poem, Garnet. Until the end, the very end. Until the end You can make believe Or you can just pretend But when the chance arrives You will see Things are gonna work out rather differently For you and me It's not over till the end Some say but I quite politely said I'd be I've been getting ready almost all my life But now I'm finally on my feet Now and then Every now and then I ask all around and wonder aloud What could I be?
the inside story of Ukrainian security services staging the death of a Russian journalist. Fake news? And what did it achieve? The fake murder that fooled the world on BBC iPlayer. Thank you.